Hi there, welcome to our video running you through a comparison of our five most popular bar style or pub style or competition style, whichever you want to kind of term it. They're the deep bodied pool tables that we sell. They're all similar but different and they've got a whole list of different features. So we've done a comparison matrix which is on our website and you can pick through all of the features that are down the left hand side and it sort of says yes, no or has some info in there. But we thought it'd be easier for me to also do a video to talk you through it all. It's easier to listen to somebody than having to read it all. But if you do want all the details, every single table has its own listing. You can see all the details on that matrix and all the details and a video exist for each one of these models. Okay, so the common features around all the tables are they are all a one-piece slate bed table. They're all English pools, so designed to play with two-inch balls, and they all have a range of cloth choices with them apart from the club, and I'll explain that to you when I go through the club table, but all of the other models, you can choose what cloth it's fitted with. So the choices are Strachan 6811, Strachan Superfine, Hainsworth, you can choose from the range of smart cloths, or Elite Pro if you want to have an American style cloth, but you could also got Hainsworth Match in three different colours on there as well. So huge range of cloth colours to choose from. Okay, let's kick off with the signature club. Um, this is the cheapest of all the tables we're going to go through, and we're literally going to go through in price order, so cheapest to most expensive. And what we've done with this table is to get a table that plays great, but hopefully doesn't cost you an arm and a leg. So we try to keep the price down by taking a few features off, and it's more focused for a home player than for use in, say, a commercial environment. So the thing we've removed is the, uh, the beading between the cushion and the rail, so there's no strip there. The uh, corner caps are smaller, so they're chrome, so they cost less to make. The feet are black plastic, um, rather than being sort of chrome effect or being chrome in itself. And the baseboard in there, we've reduced the amount of boards used, again, to keep the price down, but to still keep the table rigid. But for a home customer, where you're not gonna move the table, that doesn't matter. In a commercial environment, you'd normally use a trolley to move the table around, but you can't do that with this particular model. You've got a choice of four different finishes on there and in terms of cloth you can only choose from five different colours of one cloth type and that's Strachan 777. So it's a decent quality cloth but it's not the most expensive so again we're just trying to keep that price point down as low as we can. Okay, next up is the Signature Tournament Pro. Now this table is our best selling table and there's quite a few reasons why. It's really well specified doesn't cost you an arm and a leg and it comes in a load of different um, options or types uh, and those types are commercial so we do it in a free play version uh, for your home use but also do it in, for commercial venues so it comes with either contactless payments electronic coin mechanism or, or with a coin mechanism so it's very versatile in that way we also do an outdoor version of it as well which is made out of plywood and comes supplied with a cover and you can pop it outside leave it out there year round as long as you forget to put as long as you don't forget to put the cover on it and you'll be fine uh, from the elements so let's run you through all of the features First one is countersunk pockets. So the pocket liners on some tables are actually raised. Yeah, I guess you can probably see here on this one, they're kind of raised up above the table. On this particular table, we've designed the corner cap, the chrome cap here, so the pocket is lower there, which makes queuing over it when the cue ball is here easier because it's not raised up. You can get down lower on your shot. Okay, cue ball separator then. So this basically means that the cue ball will get separated if you accidentally pot the cue ball, it will come out of the bulk end of the table rather than on other free play tables where it comes out at the black spot end of the table. So last feature for you is we've got a foam lining in the ball box where the object balls collect just to make it quieter. Once you've potted a ball, it doesn't make a load of noise. In terms of finishes, you've got a choice of six different finishes in this table. And of course, you've got the full range of cloth options. Okay, onto our third table. It's the supreme winner. And this is probably the quintessential pub pool table. You find this in pubs and bars up and down the country. It's probably been the best seller um, for probably the last 20 years. Uh, and that's down to its design, 
the build quality, its reputation. It's used in a whole range of different competitions. Uh, it's available in 17 different finishes more than anything else. Some of those are premium. You'll need to pay a bit extra for some of those. And it's available in a free play version, which is what we've got here for home customers, but also in commercial versions. We do one with a coin mech and one with an electronic mechanism. So you can choose from that if you've got a commercial venue you want to put it in. OK, onto our penultimate table. It's the Signature Champion, which is laden with features. But let me just tell you about what it doesn't have, which is a lot of finish choices. There's only one finish currently, and that is black. Uh, and we need to do one size, and that is seven foot. All of the other three that we've run through, the Signature Club, Signature Tournament Pro, and the Supreme Winner, all come in six or seven foot sizes. OK, on to the features. First is countersunk pockets. So like we looked at on the Tournament Pro, uh, we've got low profile pockets, which make it easier to queue over it. Uh, we've got a ball window. So this is the first time ever on a free play table do you actually have a window in the side of the table where when you pot the balls, they roll into there. So you can see which balls have been potted in, what, in which order. But a lot of customers ask us whether you can get that on a table that isn't a coin mech commercial table. And this is the first one that we've ever done it on. Uh, other features, the noise reducing ball return system. So uh, in a normal table, it's got an MDF construction inside. So as the ball goes through, you can hear it knocking about inside the table. And it can be quite noisy. Uh, on this particular table, we've put fabric throughout the ball return so that it reduces the amount of noise. So if I drop this ball down pocket there, it'll make its way through the interior of the table. You can only sort of hear a little bit when it actually reaches the, the cue ball separator and the rack on the side there. So it's a lot more quiet when you're playing. Okay, onto our final table, we have the Rassen Apollo. Now this is a significant step up in price and in features. It's an entirely different beast, really, in terms of everything that it has. I'm gonna run you through the key features, but if you wanna find out everything and the key benefits, watch the whole Apollo video, which is on the actual listing on our website. Okay, so first thing really is how it's made. So it's a solid wood cabinet. All the other tables we've gone through, they're all made out of MDF. And this has steel slate supports. All the other tables that we've gone through use MDF to support the slate. So currently the Apollo only comes in one finish. We do do two versions of it though. The finish is black, but you can also have the black edition where basically those parts are black. They're anodized in black. So those three parts come through in black and give a really nice sort of dark, stealthy appearance. Okay, so it's got a one-piece cushion rail. What that means is you've got the cushion rubber is stuck to one piece of wood. They're not separate and bolted together. That rail then bolts through the slate, and the benefit of this is you get much better ball response all around the table. The uh, pocket liners are countersunk all the way around, so you can see the corner plate here. That is absolutely flush, and it also is in the middle there as well. Again, benefit is you can cue flat over that if that's where the cue ball is situated. Talking of the cue ball, it's also got a cue ball separator, so again, accidentally pot the cue ball, comes out the bulk end of the table. Okay, so that was quite a lot to take in. Hopefully it's helped. All the details, as I said, they're all in the comparison matrix on our website. If there's anything I haven't covered off, you may well find it in the individual product videos that we've got for every one of the tables that I've gone through. But even then, if you're still a bit confused, want some advice, best thing to do, give the sales team a call or pop down to the showroom or hit us up on live chat. My sales guys are all experts on these tables. They'll be able to answer any questions you've got. So that's it from me. Look forward to seeing you next time.